Welcome back. On today's video, we're going to be talking about what are some of the factors that will make your flock high failure in poultry production. You've been taken to the video by Vet Mwangi of Lamo Vet here. Don't forget to like, comment, and even subscribe. Share us where you're watching us from. As of today's topic being the causes of high, po high failure rate in poultry business. Poultry is an active business. Now, our number one point should be the lack of the technical know-how. And that's where Lamo Vet Care comes in. Lamo is a team of vets where we'll be, we have a, a nutritionists, the technical team, and we'll be able to assist you in production. We'll be able to give you the, the, the cost of production, the, the house designs and all that. So when we do that, we'll be able to get more into business and much and spoil all the way to the bank. Yes. Okay, the other way, the other point should be a manage, managerial problem, whereby uh, a, manage, a management being that there's this one very firm hand you don't want to lose, but he is the one in your agri business. There's this part that you want to have uh, poultry, your venture, your agri business is a, is a second uh, option that one will not come out it will, will you'll take you into great sources you should have the business run itself have the technical team have a manager have a farm hand and then uh, everything to uh, will be able to to get into profit you'll be able to get uh, profits from your venture instead of like uh, you have it as a uh, your rearing poultry as a part time and on the, in the in the end you're the one coming to collect the eggs in the evening when, when you're coming from work you're the one who will give water you'll this you'll distill water in your poultry flock after work and 70 percent of an egg is usually water water is is a is a factor of production that you should not you should not uh, joke around with quality feeds that's still uh the cleaning of uh, feeders and drinkers that's still a managerial uh, uh issue which you should which you should be able to work on for for you to 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 have a, uh, get more money in coping in an incompetent management may not be able to co uh, to operate profitable poultry farms yes incompetency in your management will lead you into uh, into failure in your poultry flock our third point being deceased birds diseases as a lamwa team uh personally i'm into poultry hala at any time anytime uh, you have issues with your poultry flock our numbers are streaming down this uh the screen you can engage us at any given point we can, we can do farm visits post-mortems if they are you have deceased but even on the uh, carcasses disposal we'll be able to take you through that because uh, say you have you have uh, an, uh two flocks then all of a sudden after a disease you'll throw the carcass and this dog the street dog will come and eat the the remnants of the carcass in uh, at, a, at a nearby farm who has say a case uh, uh, the cause of the disease was say newcastle you've taken the, the 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 disease to the neighboring farm or even the neighbor flock right disposal of carcasses will be able to You'll be able to uh, to take care of. Uh, you'll be able to. You'll not be able to have the failures in in your poultry flock, in your poultry farm. So the right disposal of carcasses will be able to to. You'll be able to uh, uh, get more profit in your poultry venture. hygiene how many times do you change your how many how often do you change do you change the disinfectants in your food dip hmm. i even wonder whether you have one and that's uh, a number one case where failure will come 
make sure you have a, a disinfectant in your in your in your poultry doorstep have a perimeter fence not every tom dick and harry is supposed to get into your poultry venture how many times do you clean your drinkers okay how many times have you ever cleaned your water reservoir okay and those are some of the are some of the causes that will lead you into poultry uh, failure there's something called the water acidifier the water acidifier uh, it, it, okay the molds the biofilm in your water system harbors bacteria you can use water acidifiers to clean up and flush your pipe and this bird will go forever uh, get at the best performance because quality water quality feeds the right environment hygiene uh, poor feeding condition and wastage of feeds let's talk about on layers this time around the you'll tend to find uh, a bird at, at layer stage or even grower stage at the chick stage you'll tend to find them have a lot of wastage one because you've not big your flock the beak is bigger and the birds eat because of the texture the more the, the bigger the size that's where the, the bird will be able to pick so you for the drink uh, for the feeders and even the drinkers lift them to the height of the bird of the back mgongo ya kuku when you lift them you'll be able to minimize to minimize the wastages this bird the uh, is it for your case you have the uh, the chicks you'll be able to hold water for the chi for the chicken for the layers and for the even broilers you the, 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 because this chick does not have the chicks you'll be able to like more sipping so when you have them lifted up you'll minimize the uh, you'll minimize the wastage feeds and water wastage uh housing if you get it wrong from the word go the house uh, that's where disaster comes in tag your alarm or vet for house designs even if it will mean us coming to the ground to be able to to tackle the 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 issue on on housing from the from the ground we will do that at, at your disposal available at any time Joel just you do book an appointment with us and be able to and we'll be able to handle that uh, security rats uh, soldier and snakes they should not get entry entry into your poultry coop they are they are a disaster in waiting the time bomb rats they they are vectors they are disease vectors and because you don't want to go into losses kindly find a way of uh, getting through the lama vet to give you the right uh, rodenticides in the market uh, which you'll be able to to tackle the, the the issue of rats and snakes and yeah uh, ignoring the role of livestock consultants ignoring the role of uh, your poultry consultant will make you into will take you into will lead you to poultry poultry losses don't forget to like comment and even subscribe share us where you're watching us from and even share the topic that you'd want us to discuss in our next video uh, there, there are ways of uh, poultry uh, always practicing experts every protect um, every pro profession or occupation who has functions of consultants we are here to to help you make your money we are help we are here to help this bird you are layer not to get into diseases not to get diseases uh, to have to give uh, better profits higher returns and you smiling all the way to the bank our next point is on marketing a market have a marketing plan 
if say uh, you want to sell eggs where do you take before you venture into before you venture into poultry have have a way like you have already spotted uh where to sell your eggs there is one gigi market there is a school there is even your neighbor there is even that neighbor shop there's a there's a hospital neighboring you that is the best that is the best place where you need to start uh, venturing after you've sorted your market even for broiler farming this broiler should go for six weeks uh, we can make you harvest it in even 30 days that two days 28 days but before then where will you get your market don't forget to like and see you in our next video.